So I was skeptical about these rumors at first, but now a police officer is saying that FEMA is in fact hindering hurricane response efforts in addition to not doing what they're supposed to do themselves. Listen to this and please share it. By now, everyone's heard about what's going on in the western part of Carolina, eastern Tennessee, Florida, Georgia. Donate. Please donate what you can, but please do not donate to FEMA. They are hindering a lot of what people are trying to accomplish out in the western part of the state. Now check this out. So I'm here in Boone, North Carolina. Um, I'm at the staging area. Um, I volunteered myself and my canines to come up and do some search and rescue effort. Here's the situation, okay? FEMA is in the area and we've been told that if we see any FEMA agents, like hightail it and go. So um, obviously you see all my equipment. Um, so we've been told to, to like to just like turn around and go the opposite direction because what they're doing is they're confiscating everything Like they would confiscate all of my gear my car my dogs like literally everything um, There are some people Who have been tracking these FEMA agents and what they do with these supplies after and these are people that are directly associated with the group that I'm volunteering with um, and essentially what they're doing is they're taking these supplies to um sanctuary areas for illegal migrants um and giving it all to them um, so they are telling the locals here that they have no more money that they can't give them any money they can't do anything but they are compensating volunteer supplies as they come through and they are giving it to people who are not legal i will tell you this i was 11 years in the coast guard i was in puerto rico um before and during maria and irma um, i was stationed there through all of that stuff FEMA did the same stuff there um, to the point where the Coast Guard, we did not work directly with FEMA because they were doing shady stuff. So we ended up loading a bunch of supplies and stuff and taking it around the island and delivering it. And we did the same thing after the earthquakes as well. They were confiscating supplies. They weren't issuing supplies. They mishandled money. They mishandled um, distribution of supplies and the, and the locals suffered for it. And they are doing the same thing in North Carolina. But yes, FEMA is here and they are doing really, really sketchy, shady stuff.